Welcome back everyone. It's been a while since my last Angular 2 video, but now I thought I have a good idea what I might do next with Angular 2. And here is what we're going to do next. This Angular 2 weather app. Now, what this app will do is basically it allows me here to, let's say, enter a city name like München, Germany, click add city and then we see well the weather there that it is cloudy and have five degrees celsius there and if we hover over the degrees here you see over the temperature that i also got a conversion to fahrenheit going on and showing this in this tooltip which sticks to the mouse now additionally you did not see it here within München, but let me use another city like let's say sydney can see that I already got this city found thing here which updates while I type. So if I type S we get this and then yeah well I don't know how it <laughs> finds this when I type SID but basically it updates while typing and then allows me to well add it once I got the city I want like Sydney in this case. I can also save this as a profile as you see and I got it as my new profile over here. And I can, of course, also load profiles like this default profile, which carries New York, London and Berlin, or, well, my safe profile. I can also delete profiles. This is what this app does, and it covers a lot of things that are awesome in Angular 2, and that I think will really help you build your applications. We're going to use observables. We're, well, of course, going to build components, we're going to use directives, we're going to build our own directives for this tooltip hover effect here and much more. In the next videos I will first start with a short refresher. So if you've watched all my Angular 2 videos there probably isn't that much new information but there might be some and thereafter we're going to well really dive into some new advanced stuff. See you in the next videos. Bye.